I believe this is the Good same casino evening. we were at earlier when we had to find a uh, con. Con! Yep, looks like the same casino. Huh. Oh, this ought to be good. Hey, What's this? Job. She's got her associates with her. Fennec, hit the calm. Tiana, distract the bouncer. Birch, you take the vault. Avoid the thermal sensors. They trigger the lockdown. You'll hit motion sensors, and that'll alert security. Verk, steal a uniform. You go in as security, fake the arrest. Whoops, I seem to have the wrong casino. Kasumi? <sighs> take a walk, guys. I can explain. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> You're worried that, what, I'm gonna report you or something? Come on, Kasumi, you know me better than that. I believe I hired you because you were the best damn thief in the galaxy. Yeah. Sweet talker. <laughs> oh, I can't help Are it. Hard up for can't help myself. Just to stay in practice? People uh, who can't get to the Citadel are having a rough time out there. This place has more money than it knows what to do with. It can help those refugees survive. Yeah. Good point. <laughs> she broke like the machine. can spend it if the Reapers win. Jackpot. So you're robbing the rich to help the poor? <laughs> I'm doing what I do. Raiding Cerberus bases and infiltrating Reaper held locations is fun. <clears throat> but I'm a thief. Stealing? It's who I am. Without it, I By the way, are you going to call security? No, of course not. Go, go have your fun. Just don't get caught, okay? Just don't hey, break come anything. On. I never get caught. <laughs> come on, guys. Show's on. Excuse me, is there a problem? Nah. Just catching up with a good good friend. No. No problem at all. Although I did kind of want to respond to her when she was saying that that being a thief is who she is and that without it it's like she cut herself off that she would it sounded like she was gonna say that she does she would doesn't know what she would who she would be or what she would be and i would have wanted to respond to that like kasumi you're you're more than you're more than that don't sell yourself short like that let's see where's where is wait for garris okay oh yeah get down <laughs> I guess that's what they use for crystal balls in this uh in this futuristic scenario. <laughs> staying alive, staying alive. <laughs> it's all right, it's okay. <laughs> yes, I'm aware of, I I'm twenty five years old and I know f who the Bee Gees are. Thank you. <laughs> Oh man, Garrus looking good tonight, man. Whoa, hello. That fem he caught that female's eye. Oh, she Shepherd. looked at him. She noticed him. So what do Turians usually do with their time off? <laughs> Mostly we make plans for what to do when we're back at work. I, I have some ideas on the Normandy's forward oh. cannon. I was thinking about some calibration. You know what you need, <laughs> That Mark IV silencer scope I saw at the gun shop. <laughs> oh, Garrus. I was thinking a date. Yeah. Excuse okay, it's time to go wingman here. I saw you checking out my friend. Wingman here. time. I thought you two should meet. <laughs> Hello? Right. <laughs> so, um... Oh my mm, goodness, Garrus is... Hello? Nervous. And? <laughs> and, mm. um... <laughs> Tell her she's pretty. Tell her she looks nice. You seem like a nice person. Maybe no, a little that... quiet, introspective, but... Oh my gosh, Garrus, that's not what I meant. Overall. Oh. Oh my gosh, Thank you. don't. I think. That's not what I meant. Keep it simple. Try small talk. Yeah. Come here often. I imagine anyone who does is probably an alcoholic. Oh my gosh. Actually, I do. I work at the Turian Embassy. 
I'm here to unwind. <laughs> Don't say that, Karis. Yeah. Oh, no. He's well, blowing this. I've got this thing. Uh, okay, it's time to do, do what a good wingman would do and help I him out. I should probably just go do it. Let's see. Ah! Here we go, here we go. Thank you. Here you go, man. Offer her a drink. Sorry. Let's start over again. What I've been trying to say is my name's Garrus and I'd love to have a drink with you. There you go. There you go. That's that's what that's how it works. Shepard, the ultimate wingman. <laughs> there we go. Got to help out Garrus. What can I get for you? Liquors, ale, spirits, you name it, I got it. What about information? Look, I'm here looking for information, say it, man. You like the music? <laughs> Aw, he won't talk. Tanya, you always talk to the bartenders. They always know everything. You want information? You go to the bartender. <laughs> All right, let's see. All right, I think I've talked to everyone I can at the moment. So let's head back to the apartment. I'm not going to buy the party supplies yet. I'm going to save that for last because I know that there is... A few other things to do. The way this DLC works in terms of the meetings with your with your buddies is it's a bit strange because you got to be able to you know time it right. You got to make sure to go to each area because sometimes meetings with players like the one with Kasumi just now that wasn't I didn't get a message on that so. I couldn't have known for about that unless I went over there and checked it out. Alright, so let's head back to the apartment and see if maybe we got any more messages from anybody to meet up. There's plenty of opportunities to get to meet every single member if you have done up to this point in the game. Because, as you guys saw, if I had not... If I had done this before that mission to uh, Horizon, I couldn't have met invited Miranda. I couldn't have been able to meet up Miranda because we wouldn't have reached that point. And as you just heard, it said I received new messages. Which should be like, hey, Shepard, invite me up, or hey, let's meet here. All right, before I do that, though, let's take a look at the catalog so I can decide on what I want for each area. Okay, for the bathroom. That's the standard. Hmm... I like this. I like the uh, extra counter space and the uh, the way the the cupboards are. So let's go with the deluxe for the bedding. There's the standard. And there's the simple. So black satin bedding with silver white accents for luxurious night sleep, or white cotton duvet and pillow covers for a crisp, clean Spartan look. Spartan. Ooh. Let's go with the simple. All right, next, the kitchen. Let's go with the oak. Seating, standard sofa, cozy sofa, posh sofa. Let's go with the cozy sofa. And let's see, standard armchair, recliner, ottoman. Let's go with the recliner. Recliners are comfortable. You can lean, lean back as opposed to ottomans where you just sit. The tables. Standard coffee table or light coffee table. Hmm. Hmm. You know what? Actually, I think the, uh... I like, I like this one, actually. The standard. It's actually dark, so that way, in case anything spills on it, you know, it's, uh... A lot easier to get out if it's darker. All right, the shelving, standard shelving, artistic shelving. Ooh, standard accent wall, amber accent wall. There we go. Go with that. And for the shelving, yeah, let's go with this. The artistic shelving. Aha! Look at that. It instantly changed. Look at that. That's nice. Be able to hang some pictures there. 
That's nice. Oh, and there are the recliners. There's the coffee table. Let's see. Oh, oh, there, there is. There's the the plush toy I won. <laughs> That's nice. Let's take a look at the kitchen. There it is. Different colored kitchen. Oh, here's the, uh, look at this. That's nice. I like that new look bathroom. Ooh, the bed looks much better. Yeah, I like how this looks. Very nice. Okay, now, oh, that's right. I was supposed to, uh, read my messages. Oops. <laughs> Let's see. Wow, a lot of messages. Housewarming from Tally. Shepard, next time we're on the Citadel, I'd love to come by. No rush, but it's nice to have a place there that you can call home. Memorial service from Kolyat. Commander, I was somewhat surprised to have receive a comm call from the council. They would like to hold what humans call a memorial service. Where it is held does not matter so much as who attends. I would like you to be there as well as those people on the Normandy who knew my father. I understand at human services, people speak well of the dead. It seems appropriate for you to conduct this part as the commander of the Normandy. To be honest, I am somewhat nervous. I might recall an inappropriate memory in front of everyone. Thank you. This would mean a great deal to me. Aww. From Edie. Shore leave activities. Shepard, as part of my education, I think it would be appropriate if you and I participate in rituals found in all human cultures. Reply and we can meet at the new apartment. Okay. Don't exactly know what she means, but all right. Go time from Ashley. With all this stuff about pretenders, I figured there was one more thing we had to settle. Meet me at the casino bar, you scared. Is she challenging me to a drinking contest? Aw, oh, Ash, you're better than that. All work and no play. From from Steve Cortez. Shepard, now that we've got a little downtime on the Citadel, I wanted to share something with you. I'm taking the shuttle down to Silver Sun Strip. Meet me there. <laughs> okay. Let's see. So we can invite several people up. We can invite Edie, Koliat, and Tally. Hmm. You know what? Let's invite Tally first. Let's see what Tally wants to, wants to say. Oh, hey. look at my new cozy Got sofa. For the look at that. That's a nice sofa. No. Love that. I'm as free as the dust in the solar wind. Huh? You remember that line from Fleet and Flotilla? Shalai and Bellicus on the balcony. Uh, I don't think I've ever seen that. Did. What? You've never? How could you not have? Well, I know what we're doing tonight. <laughs> oh, well, I know what we're doing tonight. What shall I? Make yourself comfortable. Because we're going to be watching the movie. <laughs> I am my duty. And you have your people. Not tonight. tonight. Oh my gosh, it's a chick flick about a, a Turian and a Quarian. Huh. It's a, rom it's a romance. <laughs> Is it Twilight? Oh gosh, no. <laughs> I love that you love this. So you've watched this a lot, huh? I guess Every you're a big fan. friends and I had a sleepover. Kila, so many feelings. Oh. Yeah, it's, uh, yeah, definitely. How much you want to bet she, done, she wants Garrus to be the Turian in this? to site <laughs> with some captioned animations. I want you to see behind this mask. <laughs> I want you to see who I truly am. I already am. She had an infection for three weeks after filming this scene. Huh. Totally worth it. <laughs> Huh. That was kind of cool. Spent an evening together watching a, one of her favorite movies. A romance, a, 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 rom a romance movie between a Turian and a Quarian. <laughs> okay. Nope. Wrong one. <laughs> okay. Uh, you know what? Let's invite Edie. We'll save the service for Thane and uh, for next. I think I'll do that in the next part. Shepard, I thought we could experience an afternoon of acquiring material possessions for our associates. You mean getting Jump. gifts. 
Not I guess shopping. Did you have Oh my gosh, mind? she's becoming a woman already. Physical proximity shopping. is unnecessary. The extranet provides a greater variety of services while receiving She's internet shopping. Value. Oh my gosh. Jeff has Online shopping. <laughs> on the condition that I enjoy myself and quote, live it up like a girly girl. Oh, Joker, you... <laughs> You, you don't have money you, of your own? You idiot. I am not formally employed. You fool. I have no legal standing in Citadel space. I could turn to crime, Tuh. but that would look bad on a resume. Yeah. We'll get you your own funds sometime. But today, <laughs> what's first? I believe Jeff would be surprised and pleased if I got him a gift. What would you recommend? Hmm. Something you both would like. Start with something both of you can enjoy. What do you do together? We interact most closely when we are flying. Hmm. It occurs to me that he does not have a sky car for traveling around the Presidium. Huh. Here, the 2187 Blackout has a top speed of 650 kilometers per hour, uh, making it the most powerful sports sky car I don't think he, he wants you to buy him that a car. That sounds like it'll get Joker's blood pumping. Five-year warranty. Replacement. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, wait. Don't buy I'm him a car. I'm see what is wrong. When you buy someone a present, it's best not to bankrupt them. Yeah, not you with his own money. <laughs> I see. Just rent it, yeah. Perhaps for a day or a weekend, then. Yeah. Who's next? You are. Close your eyes. Oh, my goodness. What did she get me? What the? Uh... Um, are we getting married? Could you explain, no. Edie, there please? There is a jeweler on the Citadel who produces these. They're made from metals from each council homeworld. Each metal compounds with the last, making the rings stronger. He calls them victory rings. Huh. Due to material shortages, only a few exist. Huh. It's almost as rare as you. Rare is nice. Unique is better. Are you... valuing me? Hmm. It's the thought that counts. And you had a good one. Yeah. I have heard that expression. That's why I recorded a resonance map of my quantum bit arrays when I had the idea. Uh -huh. If you read my extensive log files and extrapolate from my nitrogen vacancy centers, you can visualize the thought precisely. <laughs> That's a long way for a joke, Edie. <laughs> Did I have you for a few seconds there? Not even close. Uh, Who's next? Edie. I was thinking of something for Liara. Ooh. Oh, and it cuts off there. I would have liked to have known what she was going to get her. <laughs> okay.